I don't know how about you guys, but I was really hoping Clem would come through to at least get to the school. gone though like what is happening is this like just all a dream I'm, I'm pressing D to try and go to the side but I really can't oh person shot her. Put a bullet in your skull. <laughs> nah. You're good. Mercy kill him. He did nothing wrong. He didn't shoot at me. He needs to be put out of his misery. Nah, man, I'm on your side, dude. Yeah, you can see what rip, what costs that Clementine had to go through in order to get to AJ. Now it makes sense for him because this is her memory, right? So it's either trying to fill in the blanks or it's uh, putting stuff she's memorized into. Sorry. So sorry. That sounds familiar. Don't worry. Gonna that sounds like Sarah, isn't it? No, no. Oh. Ooh. I didn't actually think she was going to shoot me. You are dead. You mean I am dead dead. <laughs> I died twice. Not even right, dude. Sorry. So sorry. Don't worry. You'll be good soon. Just gotta grab a few things. Grab more things and we'll leave. Soon we'll be far, far away from here. No, no. 
I'm sorry. I had to, you were going to shoot me. You have them locked up in cages? She had the keys on her. You were gonna pull the gun. I wanna grab the gun first. I had to shoot her. Yeah. I don't wanna grab the baby bottle because I have a feeling it's been poisoned. I'm sorry. I pressed S and A. That car is going to become useful, isn't it? Same car from the beginning, so we must have kept this car around for a long time. Become. Why is this here now, though? Is the question. Like, this whole scene doesn't make any sense why it's put here. What was that? Gotta get a screenshot somewhere. Seems there's a better screenshot there, but... To Richmond. This whole area is a war zone. Well, rip hobby, I guess. <laughs> been wiring this in. Never just go alone. Mm. Friend. <laughs> yeah, that's right. AJ. It'll be okay. Don't worry, okay? 
It's gonna be okay. I know where we'll go. We'll go find ourselves a new home. Together. And I'll never leave you again. That's kind of hard to hear. <laughs> Didn't teach him how to drive, did you? <laughs> you ain't tall enough to drive yet either, is he? Oh, wait, are we looking through this through AJ's mind? AJ's perspective? Makes sense. Better life. Achievement unlocked. Hello. I'm hungry. I need you. That's a pretty big fish. Hello. How's it going, Rosie? We need to cook that first. Such a choice. She's a good girl. Is it the girl in the world? Something tells me I know where Skybound took this. Like... Got it. Getting food. Don't eat the food. Don't eat the fish, or else I'll have to hunt more. Is this our new home? Kind of see him like taking control here, like everything he's uh. You should tell Willie this is here in case he needs help. That's a pretty good. That's in the ground. Cursed. And me. I think this place is good. This place is good. Yeah. It's about right. A heart. V plus A. Pilo plus mini. Yeah, you put that together pretty quickly. He used to be their friend. How can someone just make that go away? I don't think it was just friends, to be honest, but either way. Scratch out heart. No, 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 no. Don't scratch out the heart. Pick up skull. Ah, oh, half skull. Mm, that kind of sucks, doesn't it? Being a half skull. Everyone dies. Oh no! Survivor achievement unlocked. Ah, uh, let's go outside.
I missed it. I missed it again. Darn. I'm gonna fall in the water. I'm gonna get myself killed. Oh, thank you, Rosie. It's wet and smells bad. Well, it's at the very beginning of the episode. Who might that be? We know who it is, don't we? No gun! It's tin, isn't it? It's tin! Trauma mixed him up. So we're telling his story. I think, uh, here's what I think. I think Telltale has done all of the progress up until this point, and then Skybound took it. When Skybound had to finish everything up and tighten everything and do everything they 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 kept everything from episode three and most of episode four but now skybound has to do their own little thing i think i don't know and this is what we get out of it and it's pretty neat because we're telling his mental story you know i know the others to see him it was him or lewis never hesitate You're a bad hunker, aren't you? Let's go home. Cool dog. Cool dog. Walking around. Time bomb. Wow, well that is a lot of meaning to it. Achievement block. I can't play the guitar with anything. I don't know if this is copyrighted, but what you gonna do? I missed it. Whatever. I don't care. I won't miss this one, though. Oh, this is great for this. I'm looking for the greatest point. Look at this. Epic epic, epic photo skills. Look stupid, but what are you gonna do, right? Just got a bunch of screenshot. Why is Abel's <laughs> Abel's over there? Man, do they know how to make a beautiful scene. Oh, hey, look, it's uh, Mitch, isn't it? Look at him. Hey, look, there's even uh, Lewis. 
I wonder how Lewis is holding up. Don't tell me that's the end of the episode and you only give me two acts. Don't tell me. No. That's not the end. No, you can't. Okay, thank you. Mmm. Everybody's working. Am I hallucinating? Yeah, he's hallucinating. Wait, what? No, 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 no. Well, it makes sense. And you have wood on legs. Crutches. Crutches. I found your hat. It was in the creek down by the shack. I thought I wouldn't get it, but Rosie jumped right in and got it out of the water. What? This isn't... No! It's definitely some of the other berries. You know what? You keep it if you want it. I'll put it in our room. I have a surprise for you, too. Come with me. I want to show you something. He's confused. Everybody else is confused. I'm really confused. It's a grave, isn't it? It's a tire swing. It's just for me? Yep. Lily helped me put it together. Come on, let me push you. I... I mean, it didn't end like Lee did, but I still... I, they did the same exact thing. How did Lee die? I mean, it's understandable. I thought this was a monster trap. This is my favorite day ever. I'm flying. I want to say this one just for continuity reason. What happened? It's gonna get cold. Come on, let's go eat. No one ever said amputate it. Wait a minute. Wait, 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 wait. Are there multiple endings? They didn't. They didn't. Tennessee, Marlin. And got a grave. Good dog. Ah, <laughs> oh, come on. Don't do that. It's a waste of food. Ah, there you go. At least everyone's having fun. Violet's back to seeing things, I think. Ah, it's 
call back to episode one. I could do better than that. I could do way better than that. I could do better than that. Even taste that. How are your eyes? And that's a great question. Between my patch and your stump, we almost make a full pirate. <laughs> <laughs> I wanted to wait till you were up there about how I behaved on the boat. It was really unfair. My head yeah. was so messed up. I really was playing for my own. I was so wrapped up in my own shit. It's okay. You went through hell in that boat. And I let that happen. I'm just glad we got you out of there. So Clem's... Clem's really alive. What happened? That's where Sim saw me. He was ranging out far past the traps for fear. I want you to go. You're the boss. We need to know who they are. Maybe even see if they're willing to trade. Just keep your distance until you can make a call. Who, who are Take him along with you. Group of survivors out beyond the old safe zone. Some kind of caravan. Are they bad people? Uh, no, maybe. I don't think so. You wanna come with me in the morning and find out? I could definitely use the backup. No, I don't. Trusting Lewis with the mission sounds like a dumb, dumb thing to say. Thought he was mad at me about Tin. Sounds stupid as well. Why not just avoiding them? Sounds stupid as well. We can. Uh, sorry, it's okay. I stare at it too. If it was just you and me alone out there, and I was like this, I don't know if I'd make it two weeks. How about we craft one then? Please, New leg. It wouldn't be pretty. You can still shoot a gun. Better than being a monster. We're done running. We're done running. It sounds like a good one. I'll make her a new boot. It's okay. I'll make you a new boot. Oh yeah. There must be a flint making boot somewhere. I'll ask Wade. Okay. Find me the flint book. Oh hey Rosie. I like being optimistic about things. Myself. I want to know something I 
didn't tell you? I never had a plan. I never knew where we were going. I didn't tell you anything. I just fought and fought and fought. Yeah, and hoped. You didn't notice. I hoped you'd find something before you did. Did I do a good job? Oh! Serious, of course you did. She did her best. I tried really hard. I saw the net, right? That's part of it. A big part. When you were in the barn, you didn't listen to me. Yeah, that explains it. confirms it oh boy that confirms it oh boy <laughs> oh boy Woo -hoo -hoo. if we go back and play this episode again and then tell him he's not ready will he listen and cause a different ending to happen no way dude no way I'm really just being optimistic as well about that second ending thing I'm talking about. It'd be really cool to see. Yay! Doggo does the follow. Walking. <coughs> what? <coughs> Excuse me. What? Still not bitten, team. Oh, that is amazing. This is like something you would find in like an indie game or something. Or, like, you know, so, something that's been going on for a long time like this has, dude. This is, this is, this is nice, dude. It's even at least done it correctly, like it's around everything. Skybound Games. It's got it bordered correctly and everything, too. It's great detail. Let's follow the doggo. I didn't grab every collectible. I didn't grab every collectible, but I've grabbed a couple of collectibles. Really. You now place collectibles in your room. Place the skull. Scully. Probably no one. It's probably synthetic. Or fake. Either one. Either way. Home at last. Achievement unlocked. Hang mask. What mask? Oh, that's uh his mask, isn't it? Well, I'm gonna pretend this is you still watching me. I think you like that. I hope so at least. Got a cool crystal from the cave. Not wrong. Imagination. Yeah. Uh, I don't even remember what that was. What the uh, thing was for that. Put Clementine's hat on the window when you're done. Hey there, Aldo Jr. You ready to rap? Cauliflower. Good 
flight trap. Oh, look at the flight trap. Flight trap. Both. I was gonna say sunlight, but that works too. What are you doing? Good girl. Good job. I'm gonna examine everything just because I can. I got time. Please explain how this works. Please explain how this works. Steel sleeves at the neck. <laughs> I don't know how this works. Powerful stash. <laughs> <laughs> it's a reference to one of the developers, isn't it? Now that looks like it tastes bad. Now would you eat it? It's fungus. I won't. <laughs> it's too strong, isn't it? Look at it again. Even if I could eat you, I wouldn't do it. You're too cool. Will never explained what is this guy. <laughs> I'm just getting myself hungry. There's an Easter egg for like one of these. There was, there was an Easter egg back then. Uh. I've seen things that people wouldn't believe. Toy airplanes on fire off the shoulder of Imperial Village. Ooh. I watched canned beans glitter in the dark near that one train station with a dead couple Finn tried to guilt me about. Huh. All those moments will be lost in time. Like tears in Omar Stewart. Hmm. Time to die now. Huh. You got this all from a broccoli? <coughs> the only reason I did that was because there was an Easter egg in uh, the first season where if you kept inspecting the dead, uh, you know, wife and, uh, whatever, or the couple or whatever. You'll get uh, you'll get a reference to developers, um, the first season. That's why I didn't do it. You know, that's why that's why I did do it. The greatest collectible of them all. I'm all done. All right, Rosie. I got, I got lucky with that one. <clears throat> Thank you for playing! Ah, oh, it's a thanks from the developers. <laughs> we made it all the way through, guys. We did it. Oh boy, we did it. 64% of players trusted AJ to make his own decisions. 36% did not. Ooh, wait. 
41% of play decided to add a skylight to Lewis's imaginary house. 31% denied a street house. Yeah, that makes sense. Tree house. <laughs> uh, statue of the troop selves. Flourish for his own imagination. 9%. 70% of players asked AJ to kill you rather than let you become a walker. 60% of players shot 10 after he became a walker. Spared 10 after he became a walker. 61%? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <coughs> you and 83% of players left, uh... Violet shocked. I'm gonna turn this down a bit, if you don't mind me. Shaken. Violet was disappointed that you chose to spend time with Lewis instead of her. She felt a rage after her capture. She was grief stricken about 10. 10 dead. 10 was happy. You let him draw you in his picture of the afterlife. He was bitter when he called. More, uh, he was bitter when he called you, or you called Marlin a coward. Tin felt hopeful after sharing his belief that the Walker Age will end someday. Lewis loved. <laughs> Lewis was astonished when you confessed you had feelings for him. He was uh, racked in guilt when the Raiders captured Violet. Lewis was embarrassed when he didn't want to hear why he, he was sent to <laughs> Erickson. Tin's death has left him feeling devastated. Though hopeful. James is dead. That was, what do you want? James was thankful that you respected his belief and spared the walkers. James felt elated when you said er, when you said there might be more to walkers. James was relieved when you said that you wouldn't let AJ become a killer. It didn't matter because when we did, it was. <laughs> I left. You and 50% of players left Lily shamed. I want to know how many players left him dead. Oh, he's dead permanent. There's nothing you can do about that. He's just dead. So even if I go back, I can't save him. He's just dead. Shamed. That's funny. Uh, Lily thought you might have been able to sway away to her cause. She realized AJ's potential as a soldier almost immediately. <clears throat> Collectibles, four out of four. What Clem taught? The first thing you do when you enter a new, a new place is to find the safest way out. Never hesitate. When you have to apologize, be as honest as you can, even if it's really hard. Try not to burp or fart at dinner, but sometimes you can if you think it's funny. Sometimes it's okay to take other people's stuff. <laughs> if people try to steal from you, it's okay to try and kill them? <coughs> sleeping in bed is way better than sleeping on the ground, trust me. I was wrong to kill Marlin because he wasn't a threat when I shot him. Even if you have to atone to something, it's hard, but people will forgive you. Whenever you're scared, just try to push through, the, push through it. The monsters won't be here forever. Killing is never easy or fun, so take it ser real seriously. Sometimes torturing people is okay, I guess. <laughs> Doctors can help you... Uh, help with your trauma, but I think they're all dead. <laughs> I thought maybe there were people inside monsters, but that was dumb. There's nothing in them at all. If someone asks to tell you something real bad, they do. They did it a long time ago. Say no thanks. Firefighters have to make the hard calls, and the hard calls are always unfair. That's that's. That is way more true than you think it is. Like, it's more than unfair. Your choices. Gut through the window. Uh, there was a choice with Abel? I don't know what this is. Oh, because I went, I went with, uh, I went, uh, I went hunting. I pushed Abel, but apparently there was another choice with Abel. 
I went with Lewis. I can assume this is either me atoning him, atoning him or not. Either way, he's dead. Burying and not burying. Oh, having a relationship with oh, that's that's a good that's a good set of uh, uh of uh <coughs> choices to make. Having a relationship with them or not, you know, saving Lewis over Violet, Mercy, Abel, <laughs> killing all the Walkers or not killing all the Walkers. I decided I wasn't going to kill the Walkers because that didn't make any sense. So Lily would have been dead. Oh wait, no, that's that's the same face, isn't it? So I was right. I was right. I said that he would jump in the bullet and get hit. So either that's Lily or that's hit. That, that looks like Lily, to be honest, but whatever. Uh, I let him attack immediately instead of leaving Lewis's hands cut. What is this? Oh. If, uh, if I want to trust him or not. Yeah. Yeah. Something happens to... No! No! Violet or Lewis would have died over tin. <laughs> he made the hard call himself... Oh no! Oh boy! Oh boy! Oh boy! Oh boy! So they would have died in ten, would have survived. You're, you're joking, right? Like, come on! Ah, uh, I did the axe to Clem for some reason. Oh, was there a choice of leaving her? I swear, there's multiple endings to this game, because um. If you don't trust him, he might actually, like, leave you or actually kill you. So that might lead to a whole other thing. And then uh, there's either leaving Tin alone or shooting him. I shot him because... <laughs> never hesitate. But there is an option where he still lives. As can seen by these little two options, which I personally don't want to ever happen. Even though Tin's really cool, I guess. Like, Clem taught me. All the collectibles were found. You and 50% had her shamed. You and 13% and Lewis, uh, love. Uh, everybody had 10 dead. Well, that doesn't tell me the percent of how many people had dead, so I'm assuming I could have let <clears throat> AJ shoot, uh, or it would have been over. 83% had her show. Okay, so everyone practically had her. <laughs> uh, yeah. Yeah, I just wanted to see that. So 10 can survive, it just doesn't want to show me the percent. It also can tell me that James survived, but it doesn't also want to tell me that. So... Yeah. <sighs> Updating content. Signing in. <clears throat> so. So that's it. That, that's it. That's it. The Walking Dead is over. The Walking Dead is over. Wow. Wow, 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 wow. So, we started off, um, started off in season one. I played this, to get a perspective on this, I played this, I played The Walking Dead on my TV back here. Like, that was so long ago. When I had the Xbox, I didn't have a laptop or nothing. It was just the Xbox. I remember how I did everything. Just to tell you how old this is, how old it is, this is my new phone. Back then it was more like a brick, wherever that's at. And... I would record like that, and I made like three parts of that, and then I got a laptop, then I bought it on Steam, and I played through it. Crappy audio quality, if you want to go back and go do that, 
crappy audio quality in mostly everything I did back then because I didn't have really anything, like, good. Like, th back then it was webcam webcam on the, the, the laptop and um, microphone from the laptop. And that's what it was. <clears throat> I played all the way through season one like that. And I did everything like that. When I came to season two, that was in that was released, and <clears throat> or that was like released way long, way way after. And I finally bought it on Steam, and I played through it through it on my own. But get this: um, the only reason I got into The Walking Dead was because I'd watched it. I've watched a whole series about it. Uh, thanks, Pewds, uh, again. Uh, great uh, series. And I got interested in it. I wanted to play it for myself to see what I would get. And of course, lose no choice. But still, like, it was a great game. It still is a great game to what it is. And, um, yeah, and I had watched the playthrough all the way through it. And I also watched all the way through the season two as well. <clears throat> I played it. However, when it came to season three... I, uh, when I came to season three, I was completely blind. I had no idea what I was getting myself into. So, yeah, I will get to that when I talk about season two. I played through all the way through season two. I mean, you can tell my recording style as well as audio was bad as well, as well as recording most of the episodes all in one part, except for a couple here and there. I think um, I don't remember much, uh, but that was great. It was still good time. And Clem was still is still alive, surprisingly. And then you had the Walking Dead season three, which I was completely blind in, and I enjoyed because I was I was going in blind, I had no idea what I was doing, meh. And um, you know, I did that, and that was, I think that was back in the other in the corner, not like out having it set up like this and having what I call a backdrop aka a blanket behind me hanging off the off the ceiling but I'm not complaining I actually enjoy this more than having the nice uh, wood uh, background yellow wood background because it keeps everything nice and atoned to everything in the background sometimes I do you know it's not a green screen. I could get a green screen back here if I wanted to, but I'm not doing that. I'm fine with the blanket. The blanket works just fine for me. And, um, yeah, I played all the way through that like that. And, um, yeah. It was, um, <clears throat> interesting, to say the least. Um, because I, I enjoyed what the, what they were telling of the story, because as a story to whole, I don't, I didn't really care for the choice based situation even though it did matter here and there even though it led to the same ending <clears throat> it's how you got there it's not how it's not it's not what got your no i don't even know how the saying went i had a thing i would say it's not about the ending it's how you got there that matters you know that's what it mostly was around this these times because sometimes yeah the ending would be similar to the same except there's an exception to this season two had multiple endings which is interesting. Season 3 had multiple endings. I didn't go back and do that, actually. Uh, way more endings. <coughs> and a, um... Yeah, and there's... The one game that was in between Season 2 and Season 3 was Walking Dead Michonne, which I had some interest in. But I'd already watched a playthrough, and I didn't really have any interest in... playing it. And I can't even get it anymore. Because all the stuff from Telltale is gone. Mostly, anyways. Anything related to The Walking Dead. Because it's licensed or titled by uh, Skybound. Skybound's got all that all that other fun stuff. Mm. So, yeah. Here's hoping Skybound re-releases these games. Because that'd be pretty cool. I might play through it. That was like the, that was like the thing for like the TV series for Michonne. Then it came to this season. This season was an interesting one. Because I enjoyed it. But I knew Telltale and I knew where they were going to go with it. 
and this, surprisingly it didn't go that route. And um, I'm surprised Clem is alive to begin with. Uh, because the amputation trick never worked in previous uh, seasons, to say the least. But Which is a little odd, though, because... I wouldn't say it's continuity. It's a continuity error, I do believe. Because we, I chopped off Lee's arm. It could have been because of blood loss, to be honest, that he died. But then again, when Clemby in the same boat, the, the leg carries more blood to the vessel than anything else, right? So... A second of all, how did AJ even get her out of the barn? Nobody else knew that barn existed, so... I mean, that's a good way to pick apart, pick that apart. If anyone's interested, I know there's a one of those coming up. But oh, I enjoyed it. I enjoyed it. <clears throat> These changes to the game came way too late in the seasons. The way they had the combat sections and everything like that, they came way too late, especially when it's the final season. Um, you know. With all this fun stuff and all that, kind of, you know. One question I have is: they had the ending come up as, you know, this is it. They're 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 making it, and you know they're doing this. You know they're 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 home. You know in a sense. But, you know, it's never going to be like that when, you know, the huge horde comes by. Take, for example, the huge Walmart that <laughs> was uh, barricaded and everything in Season 2 that got overwhelmed pretty easily, even though we were a part of the sabotage. And even then, you know, it was all utter chaos, you know. And there was also the caravan thing that they were talking about as well, where uh, they had a... Uh, Lewis and AJ go out and go check out the caravan. Problem is, is like, what what happens then? Is if they're traitors, the traitors are cool. But otherwise, it's what do you do? It's really open ended to put into perspective what could happen. I just really want to see the story continue in some way, shape, or form. But I bet it's going to be like a comic if, if it continues. It won't be another game, especially considering it says this is the final season. But, you know, sad to see this game go, I'll be honest. Um, I still, though, have Life is Strange to go in through. Uh, I did buy Life is Strange um, Beyond the Storm, or whatever. I don't remember the, the... Before the Storm, not Beyond the Storm. Before the Storm. So, uh, when I get done with Life is Strange, I'll immediately hop on that. And then uh, play uh, the Captain, whatever. Captain. Captain this really long name. But it's apparently like a teaser for uh, the second season of Life is Strange. And, um. Yeah, I'll do that. And, uh, you know, all that fun stuff. Fun fact I was going to play the Captain, whatever game before I even played Life is Strange, but then I realized how bad of an idea that was. And, uh, yeah, stop. But, uh, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this run through of The Walking Dead. This game won't die with me, by the way. Uh, it's a great game. And, and, at some point, I have planned to go back through the rest of the games and change up a couple of the choices that I've done. I don't know when that'll be. Probably when I have a bunch of extra free time that doesn't mean, you know, playing uh, other games and stuff. Change a bunch of choices and all that fun stuff, and you guys will get to, you know... Play with, or like not play with me, or um, join me in another run through of uh, all of these seasons. Uh, see what's different, as well as better audio quality and quality in general. And uh, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. I sure have. And uh, here's looking towards the future. See you guys next episode. Bye bye. Or whatever I make. Uh, this was like the big series on my channel um this is like this series I've been following on my channel for a really long time so 
I don't know what I'm going to do now <laughs> for another big series. I think Fallout New Vegas is going to be the new big series other than Life is Strange because I've been doing a lot of Fallout stuff recently. I've gotten like to part 30 already in Fallout New Vegas in the past couple months surprisingly quickly. Uh, so those two games might take up the big, big spot for longest running game on this channel. Longest running series on this channel actually. So... Uh, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. I'll see you guys next episode. Bye-bye!